Now let's go about getting this cockpit glass uh, sitting in this frame. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to select this frame that we have and I'm going to set uh, select the cockpit glass. I'm going to move it just temporarily to layer three by pressing M and then the number three. So I'm going to select three to go to layer three. And now what we have here is we've got the original glass and we want to keep this shape, but we want to move it all in um, so it sits properly. So what I'm going to do is in the glass, I'm going to shift D and right click to recenter it. I'm going to remove the solidifier modifier and on the other one I'm going to remove the solidifier modifier as well I'm going to pick number three so let's call this um, glass and we'll call it mesh glass and we'll call this severe here we'll call this mesh underscore glass frame so I will select the glass and I'm going to add in a modifier called shrink wrap. And what we're going to do is we're going to kind of um, shrink wrap it to Sphere 2 which is the other glass. And so what this does is now if I go into edit mode, I'm going to turn on proportional editing by pressing O. If I pick this point, no matter where I move it, it'll still be stuck to the surface of the other glass. Um, if I just keep above surface, offset. So we can see that I've just offset it a bit, but you can see it's kind of still keeping that shape. So let's just put that back down to zero. Control Z, Control Z, let's get back to where we were. So now I'm just going to just use the proportional editing tool just to get it back to sitting where I would like it to go. GZ. Beautiful. Let's just push that up a little bit. Let's G and I'm just going to use a mouse wheel. So I kind of want that all to sit in there. I wonder if I can actually just hide this. Hide. Beautiful. And it keeps that. All right, so we've got this here that we want to move up. Move that in, move that in, move that in. Let's go above there. I do want it still sitting above that surface. Let's just move that in a little bit. And so that glass is now sitting within the frame. So let's now, I'm going to push that up one. No, because let's leave it as is. Uh, but on severe two, we will call this mesh underscore glass underscore dummy. And I'm going to turn off visibility for it. And I'm also going to turn off rendering. So if I do render something, I'm not going to see it. Um, I don't want to apply the modifier just yet, uh, purely for the fact is, is if we just want to do some edits a little bit later, that option's still there. I am going to add the solidifier modifier back in. Okay. And that's looking good. That's all looking pretty on the inside. And in the next section, we're just going to fix up this bit here.